Hello, I'm Michelle Masonville, certified doula and owner of From Womb to Cradle Doula Services. If you've been following our web series, you've already learned how a doula can help you throughout pregnancy, birth, and the postpartum period. We've also covered some of the frequently asked questions about doulas. Today, we'll be discussing how you can afford a doula to help you have a beautiful birth. When it comes to fees, most doulas take an initial deposit. The percentage varies. Payment options, such as splitting the fee into three or more manageable payments, are often accepted, with the final payment due a few weeks prior to the estimated due date. Many doula practices have such payment plans available to help you easily afford the support you desire. Currently, I am not aware of specific insurance companies in Canada that cover doula care, especially since a doula is not a medical professional. However, that doesn't mean that you shouldn't check with your insurance provider just in case. Note that at least in the United States, some providers limit you to doula certified only by one or two specific organizations. If you have a health spending account, you may be able to use some of your savings to pay for your doula. If you are a small business owner and offer a product or service, your prospective doula may be willing to barter with you. You can pay a portion of your fee with cash and barter products or services for the remaining amount due, or barter for the entire amount less the deposit. Some examples of services might include photography, vehicle maintenance, or graphic design. Products may range from home-based business items such as food storage or cooking utensils, to therapeutic oils or even food produced on a farm or ranch, such as a portion of a cow, butchered chicken, vegetables, or other items. We always appreciate being able to provide fresh local food for our families. Many, if not most doulas, offer a sliding fee scale, though they may not always advertise them. This means that if you are able to demonstrate financial need, you may qualify for services at a reduced rate. Depending on your area, there may be an active doula association that keeps track of doulas in training. These doulas have to attend a certain number of births in order to complete certification requirements. These doulas may only charge a basic fee to cover their expenses, such as childcare and transportation. They can be a very affordable option. Other doulas in training may volunteer with various agencies that provide services to women facing an unexpected pregnancy or families who are struggling financially. These doulas provide services free of charge. An interesting idea many mothers-to-be are beginning to use is creating a registry of sorts where friends and family members can make deposits to a doula fund in lieu of gifts for a baby shower. Depending on the time of year you're expecting, you may be able to host a garage or yard sale and put the proceeds towards your doula fund. Facebook also has garage sale groups that you can use throughout the year. Stay on the lookout for deals. Doulas may offer discounts at certain times during the year, especially when celebrating the anniversary of their practice. You may also receive a discount for referrals or if you are a repeat doula client. Thank you so much for tuning in. Next week we'll be discussing my top five pregnancy, birth, and breastfeeding books. If you have any comments or questions about our video series, please leave us a note here on YouTube or email me at wombtocradle at gmail.com. For more information about our practice in Lethbridge, don't forget to visit our website at www.wombtocradle.ca. Remember, if hiring a doula is a priority for your family, you'll definitely find a way to make it work.